Hello and welcome back to Let's Play We Happy Few, We All Fall Down with me, Bring It Dawn. So I'm just going to make sure there's no uh, secrets afoot. Like in here. Some contraptions, a trap door, no notes. Let's see, a proper attic. Wait for me to drop down safely. I guess I have to do it over there. I do have enough for I do not. I could probably take him on. I really haven't stealthed my way through any of this DLC so far. I'm gonna try it here. He would go somewhere. So now how do you get up there? So far, so good. And that looks like that might be the way I have to go. Or is this the way I have to go? Well, let's go take a peek back here. I don't want to get trapped and not be able to come back and find more contraptions. This looks like a bit of a dead end. Alley stash key. So I think I need to open up that, right? Yeah, that's where the... I think my voice just cracked. That's alright. I'm not almost 30 years old. Voice still cracks. So why would I be able to come over here? What do I gain from this? Doesn't seem like a whole lot, honestly.
Secret stash location in Waterloo District. Is that where I'm at? I don't have a map, do I? It could be over there. Sure, we'll give it a shot. Oh, jeez, okay. Well, that didn't go right. Can I fight them from over here? I can, okay. Well, hey. This got a lot easier. Okay. Well, this is where we came from. So I drop down here. Okay, well. So much for the stealth approach. Alright, let's get out of here. I've wasted too much time in this in this section. If I'll find a stash, so be good. Someone. So they can sniff you out. I forgot about that. All right, time to leave. Not sure where that alley stash was at. Maybe it's in this area? I can't wait to see how they fixed up Lutz Hall. Did you hear they've caught Foggy Jack? Isn't that a relief? Uh, 
Well, that's the Bailey District. That's the Waterloo District. So it says there is a, uh... I don't want to leave that key behind. Lost secret stash location in Waterloo District. And that is here. We'll go back and we'll just give it a once more. A once more round and then uh, we'll head back. So I don't want to leave a stash behind. There's only so many alleys. Let's get back up top and see if we can't find a, uh... An alley that maybe we missed somewhere? There's that one, that's the one we came from. The rest of them are closed off, I think. Maybe... <sighs> oh yeah, healing bomb. Sweet. Yeah, I don't see any other alleys. I don't know where, uh... I don't remember seeing anything locked in the alleys that I've been inside of. So I think I'm out of luck. Alright. Just get out of here. I don't think we'll be coming back here, that's why I wanted to find it, but I don't know where it's at. Allocator ought to be on the other side of that canal. What's that he's got there then? Some sort of toy? To think, he used to be the head of counterintelligence. <laughs> you never know who'll go down the next. Might be you. Might be me. Oh, I need to go spend a penny. Then we can book him proper. That's Johnny Bolton. He'd run off to the garden district. He's got some sort of gun. Calling sentry. Alright, classified memo, super top secret clearance from Special Agent Johnny Bolton, counterintelligence, to Special Operations Executive. If I remember correctly, this guy was the guy that, um, in the main story, he's the one that has you go rescue like a doll. And things like that. Like he's he's based out of a treehouse in the gar in the garden district. Anyway, alert, alert, alert! I've been given some ultra top secret, super high quality intel by my network of brave agents, which are a bunch of toys and dolls. It has led me to a terrifying conclusion: the awful and villainous Verloc scary schemes are winding to an end. He and his minions and the executive committee are working towards what they are calling a permanent solution. My surviving agents are frantically combing the field for more clues, but at this point, we can wait no longer. Must implement Operation Underlord. Now, now, now. Be brave. Special Agent JB. Ah. Come in. Special Agent. Alright, so actually with this, we're going to go back to the Waterloo District. Because there was that one... Conductor. 
next to that window. We might have to go back there at some point anyway, because there, there are a bunch of conductors all over the this DLC so far. But, I think this is a, is a solution to my previous problem. Because that there is that window up top. Took no fall damage. Fantastic. I want to let me grab onto that. Come on. There we go. That's weird. So this is just a shortcut. Okay. Dark gun. Let's see what can we get. Does have enough for a uh, upgrade? I don't have enough for an upgrade. So this just opens up a shortcut. So we'll probably have to come back this way later, right? Ah, here we go. Found the stash, everybody. Got an achievement for it as well. Now we have enough for an upgrade. Check out taller enemies, which might come in handy. Uh, soft landing. Chase for electricity from one electrified enemy to another using the whip. Cool. Let's do this. That sounds like fun. Past your bedtime. Happy. You need to be happy. All right, cool. Well, hey, I got the stash. Let's, uh, let's continue with the, the quest. Enough wasting time. You know, unlike the other DLC, I'm not sure how long this one's supposed to be. The other DLC were both uh, about two hours apiece. This one I wasn't, I have no idea. Um, how long it's supposed to be. I 
so a few directions I can take you. Not sure which path is going to net me the most quote experience points. Alright, so I can't climb on top of that. How do I get up? Probably that way. these, at least not effectively. be able to jump over there. I don't see a game there. I guess it's just another way across. I want to test it out. I can't believe we built an elaborate system of pipes to allocate pills to the mood booths. Whose idea was that? I hope not mine. So I'm curious. Hmm. Deal with it later, I guess. I'll grab the soft landing. Why not? That might be the way back out. Pointed out, use the whip to choke everybody out. Hey, what are you doing there? Nothing. Hmm. 
So that looks like it's going to be the way out. And again, maybe not. <gasps> Probably. Alright. And once you destroy this allocator, then they will be willing to listen to reason. Once they've calmed down. You have such a touching faith in the common English man. Highly classified. Ultra classified memo from Special Agent JB to Special Agent JB. Note, this memo is so highly classified it may only be read agents with the highest top secret MK ultra security clearance. There's only, su there's only such agent and it is me. Only one such agent? If you are reading this note and are not me, you're a breach of security protocol. While the prime number one target of Underlord remains the extra villainous Verloc, we must not forget his lackeys. The menacing Robert Bing, codenamed Paper Tiger, and Victoria Bing, Shere Khan. <laughs> These prowling tigers are responsible for the corruption of our town. What for exactly? The exiles. The children. Why no more? The plague. Quibono. All those horrors. They all led back to their haunted manor. It is our duty as members of the Special Operations Executive to hunt down these snarling wildcats of corruption. Run and jump. Sure. Oh gosh. Well, oh, sure. We're out of here. Alright, we did good work. This is the third booth we've tried. They're never empty. How can they be empty? I'm starting to feel rather down. Oh, I don't like this. Not at all. Hold on now. There's joy in the water pipes. Isn't there? Yeah, yeah. Let's run home and make a nice cup of tea. There's joy in the water. You really thought of everything, didn't you? Okay, yeah, I guess I did. All right, going to call it here. In the next episode, we will uh, go to Dunker Town, Dunker Tin, not Dunker Town. Let's see about um, stopping the water. I guess. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next episode.